Welcome to another edition of Eat My Shorts. The, uh, I can get on camera now edition here, right? Unboxing. Get your youth gun gun safety act pamphlet. Fucking garbage. Activate your warranty. Nonsense. Target. Okay. Owner's manual. Now we're getting somewhere. Alright, more warranty and lead hazardous information. Okay? If you've never handled a gun before, read your manual. If you're somebody like me, who uh, keeps their shit ready to use, this video is probably more geared towards you, okay? Taurus 856, chambered in 38 Special Plus B. It's a nice little handgun, right? Proper way to unload, load a revolver, right? We all know that. Single action, nice and crisp. Double action, nice and crisp. Rudimentary sights, I modded this one to have a uh, little bit of glow so you can actually see when you line your gutter up. And you can get a nice clean squeeze that way. Speed loaders. Let's talk about those. All right. Proper carry ammunition. Liner up. Drop her in. Gun's back in the fight. All right. Do it again. All right. Another. Pop it in there. Good to go. Uh, this was originally my dad's gun. I bought it actually, and uh, he ended up with it because he was old. He was infirmed. It's a nice little gun. I did do an aftermarket grip on it. The factory one is right down here. That pin's a bitch to drive out. All in all, what do I think about this gun? Well, having about 50 rounds through this gun, I think it's a nice little gun. If you're older, you're infirmed. If you have uh, grip strength issues, you know, and you can't rack a slide, but you can pull a hammer back, this is probably up to your speed, okay? And for my fellow Bujahadeen fighters, right, all of us trapped behind enemy lines or uh, in band states, okay? What does that mean for us? That means that this, a Colt pattern, a Smith & Wesson pattern, an EAA Vindicator, literally any number of firearms you may encounter are this type. Now, a Colt catch pulls backwards, right? This is Smith style. It's a Taurus 856 and 38 Special Plus B. It pushes forward. I like the Smith catch guns a lot better. But this is the newer style. It does not have the firing pin fixed to the hammer. And it does have a transfer bar. But all in all, it's a nice little gun. I stoned the action on it myself. I made it nice and smooth. And uh, that's basically what you get when you buy a brand new revolver. You get the gun, the standard grip, not the sight modded. Uh, some instructional literature, and uh, you have to buy ammunition and speed loader separately. So, um, what's the take on this? What's this gun used for? That gun right there is used to get to a rifle, okay? And I'll demonstrate now. Right? You use something like that to get to something like this right here. Some fucking sling snag. Right? Something like this, okay? Th that's what you have. This is your primary defense weapon, right? Especially if you're in a serious situation. That's to get you there, or that's to get you out of a bad spot. So I hope this uh, helps somebody. This is my very first gun review video in person, live and in color, with animation and sound. So uh, as always, keep calm, carry the fuck on. If you don't like it, eat my shorts.